March favourites, so let's just get straight into it. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with beauty slash skincare items, and not too many. I don't try out new products all the time. Okay, so the first favourite is this number seven metallic eye pencil in the colour 07 camouflage. It's just a coal eyeliner, but it's a really beautiful sort of olivey green, blacky, goldy colour. Really, really beautiful. I really like it smudged quite low under the eye. Lovely as an all-over eyeshadow colour if you wanted as well. And I'm preferring using a lot of these dark metallic colours like greys and navies over black. I just think I just think they add a little bit of a little something special. And because it has a little bit of glitter and shimmer in it, it just sparkles and catches the light beautifully. And yeah, that's the number seven camouflage metallic eye pencil. So the next item is this Body Shop All-in-One Insta Blur Cream. I use this as like a primer, so after my moisturiser, before my foundation. It says it's a five action perfecter. I don't know what five things it claims to do. I feel like it slightly mattifies and just makes your pores look a little bit smaller. So anywhere where you get a bit oily, pop this stuff on. I do have the sort of, I think the BB cream thing that goes with it. That's nice as well, but more for summer. This is great under pretty much all of my foundations. So if you're in the market for a new primer and you don't want to splurge too much, this one's great. It's the Body Shop Insta Blur. Now next item, I haven't stopped wearing it. I'm wearing it now, wore it in my last video. And it's the MAC Viva Glam 3 Lipstick. It's in a matte finish and it's just a beautiful colour. It's very in keeping with that whole 90s brown thing going on, but I feel like it has more of a... It has a slight sort of warm ready burgundy undertone to it and I find it a bit more wearable than just a normal brown and yeah definitely check out MAC Viva Glam 3 I don't hear that many people talk about it but I'm talking about it and I'm telling you it's good so go and get it <laughs> so the next thing is the Makeup Revolution Ultra Cover and Conceal Palette I have been reaching for this like non-stop this month um, the colour that I use is this one here it's like the second darkest one so I'm thinking I might be better off buying the dark kit because then I can use the concealers as contours as well. They still have some lovely colours here, great for highlighting and I really like the consistency of this. It's just really, really thin. It blends in beautifully using the Real Techniques Miracle Sponge. And yeah, I really like this concealer palette. For £6, you're getting eight concealers. It's amazing. Love it! Okay, so on to TV. It's not going to be any surprise. But in the month of March, Comedy Central finally released The Roast of Justin Bieber, and I've watched it, and it's hilarious. If you haven't heard of The Roast, what it is, Justin Bieber asked Comedy Central for his 21st, 22nd, God knows how old he is, um, to be roasted for his birthday. So basically, a group of comedians and celebrities will just rip the shit out of him, and he gets to have his turn um, at the end as well. And it's just, it was very funny, very humorous. Props to him for actually wanting to do it. Celebrities that were featured were my Uncle Snoop, love him, uh, Martha Stewart who was really really funny and ludicrous, Shaq was there. It was definitely definitely a good watch, couldn't stop laughing and if you like that then check out the roast of James Franco and Charlie Sheen as well. But yeah, the roast of Justin Bieber, definitely a March favourite. Okay, now it's time for my song that I love this month. I know a lot of you people look forward to this moment. And this month, I can't get enough of L.A. Priest. And I don't know how you pronounce the song. I think it's called... Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. And I'm just going to give you a snippet. It's super cool. It kind of reminds me of, like, Napoleon Dynamite. And, you know, when the grandma's, like, in the sand dunes? I just imagine her, like, going crazy with it. But let's give you a snippet. And that was L.A. Priest with Oh No or Onya, oh, I'll leave it down below for you guys. Okay, so moving on to Munchies of the Month. So it might 
seem like every man she is related to Nutella. I'm sorry, but that's just my life. Nutella is my life. And um, this month's munchie are crumpets. I can't get enough of crumpets, especially when they're just warm and you put butter on them. And then obviously some Nutella. And when you spread it on when it's warm and then you take a bite and then all the chocolatey, hazelnutty goodness just seeps down and through the holes. And when you smile, you just get like brown Nutella all over it. It's a good time. I love it. I just want to take a bite. Oh my goodness. Sweet so, Nutella is going everywhere. Like my muscles of the mouth. Mm. That's an Nutella smile I was saying. And that's all my favourites guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to give this video a like, to subscribe and stay tuned for more. Peace! Hey, it's just me again. I'm just letting you guys know that you can check out my last video by clicking on the box just there. And whilst you're at it, don't forget to click the subscribe button too. Peace!